Hey guys, it's Patrick Houston here. I've got a few quick exercises for you to do today to just help yourself stay mobile and active, whether you're at home, whether you're out in your daily exercise. Um, it's really good just to get things out open and loosened. So we're gonna start with hip opens. I recommend you do this, I'm in bare feet. I recommend you do this in bare feet if you're at home. What we're gonna do is we keep the hips level, keep the pelvis in the same place, lift the leg up, rotate the leg out to the side, and now we're not opening the pelvis with it. Leg up. Out to the side, back down. Rotate back in, up. Rotate to the side, down. Now this rotation is happening inside your pelvis, inside your hip joint. You're gonna gain some new control of your hips, some new movement. You might be a bit stiff, you might be uncontrolled. Don't worry, it'll come. And then we'll swap to the other side. I know I just skipped out on that rep. Rotate. This hip's got a little clunk in here at the moment. I've got so much tension in my body, shooting a, a 54 or 55 pound bow for years um, without knowing how to loosen my body, without knowing how to, uh, how to keep things mobile and, and, and loose and more functional, um, I've developed so much tightness. I'm getting through it well, but um, yeah, there's still loads of it. I keep finding new bits. Very good. So now we'll swap back to the other foot. Now when you're doing this barefoot, spread your toes. This really helps your one-legged, one one -legged, one footed balance. Um, spread your toes wide, big toe, little toe. They're the front points of your tripod back to your heel. The base of them, you can press them into the ground. You can go on short foot. So you're spreading your toes, tensing your feet. You can not lock your leg, have it slightly bent. You could maybe, depending on how good your body feeling is, um, you can feel your whole body stiffen through that point. Anyway, now we're gonna start at the bottom. I'm going to start at the bottom, rotate the leg there, inside the hip, so my foot is pointed that way. Lift it up, Ooh, come in, down, rotate, lift it up, come in, and then down, rotate, lift it up, come in, down. You might get some clunking, you might feel things stretching in your hip, that's fine, just don't go anywhere that's painful. Swap onto the other leg, spread the toes, big toe, little toe, rotate, up, in, down, and then we rotate. A lot of people's hips, you'll find, you may know people that like this, you may be like this yourself, they don't have their hips and they're centrated is the word I believe. I've never heard that word before, I didn't make it up. Centrated, generally set up biomechanically correct. Um, so there's a little video for you today on um, hip opens. Join me next time where we'll do some hip opens and then get into horse stance. You can follow that video on from this one or um, or do that video and then this video. I don't, I don't really mind, whatever you like. Anyway, I hope you have a great day. It's Patrick Houston. I hope you've, uh, it's Patrick Houston here. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Um, so yeah, open up those hips. Have a great day.